All right, guys, welcome back. I know, I know, I know. You know what? <laughs> I'm gonna put that video out. I, I feel like I feel like I didn't give you much, but you know what? That's the gameplay of this. And clearly, if you've gone along for the ride for this long, you gotta understand that the sh the the shop part. Well, that's that's why we're here. People be shopping. You know, we gotta we gotta f highlight both sides of the game because I mean, the dungeon crawl. This is is great but you know the shop part of it's what what you're really here for what the hey okay. now you know if you're gonna start that with me i'm just gonna poke you with a very long stick okay swirling magic stuff at me well don't lose it down the okay i know like nothing of here so i know nothing of the ways of the desert except I do know the ways of dice. Whoa! Not lava dice! No. People! People. Inanimate objects made of lava! I got... Then you pee a lava stream on me. Did I wear my asbestos underwear today? Because, uh... I'm gonna need it. Resistant glass. Okay. I am not flame-proof, people. Also, this equipment needs to be upgraded right this second. And that's bad to say, I just upgraded. But I am ready for another upgrade. Oh, and if you're watching this, and you see that I didn't check out a secret room, please feel free to comment in the low, doofus. You missed one. Or, you know, whatever feels the need. Ransacking. <laughs> These dungeons are arranged to assist in the ransacking of them. But there is a glitch in the system, an anomaly working against their design. The guards, they work autonomously without thought. Their only concern, the defense of the treasures in the dungeon, which seemed in direct conflict with the dungeon's sole purpose. I'd wager whatever place the guards here is separate from what forms the dungeons. Brilliant, brilliant insight. From, I'm guessing, Crazy Pete, even though he died back in the other one. How did he get here? Hey, Pete. Inquiring minds want to know. Hey, stupid. No. Come on, just die. Great. We went from six sided dice to like what? 12? 50? Come here, come here, come here. Don't be throwing my loot off the edge of the thing. It's hard enough to get in here and get this stuff. Yes, I've been playing and practicing a little bit. I hope I look a little better out here in the field. Out here in the field. Oh. It's. I've also learned a few things. Now. Ooh. Like you only see that circle when you're going the direction that the boss is, or the, you know, the forward direction is. Just fine. It'll be fine, just fine. <laughs> yeah, you really don't need to block those doors with fire. I understand. You could put a sign up with a post-it that says don't go this way. I would listen. Okay. You know, I really want to go down another floor, but... This is only 67% explored. I can't pass that up. Nope. Data entry 103. The reason stores shortages are no longer considered errors in, in, keep, in keeping. Materials and various tools are actually vanishing on a daily basis. A guard program is being created to keep an eye out for the intruders. Mm-hmm. So... Somebody f are these was that note left by somebody who like keeps tabs that whoop <laughs> Okay. This diagonal stuff's gotta stop. <laughs> I really don't think I can block that. I'll be darned I can. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> 
sometimes they just they send it to you in like a sideways motion that negates your shield what am I missing how what what was that all about Did I just... Did I just step in the lava, I guess? <laughs> I guess. Oh, this has a secret. I saw it. I'm going in! Oh! Cross your fingers out there, boys. Girls and... Everything out there. <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> Woo. My dodging skills are at peak performance. <laughs> Along with my staying out of the way skills. Those are always good skills. <laughs> Do I need to catch you at the other corner? Oh, decide to roll backwards, did we? Okay. I mean, as much as I really want to... Nah, I've got room. Let's go. Let's top this baby off. I want a good couple hundred thousand here. Yeah. Send out them slimes. Don't slime me. Yikes. He hit me. Quit building... There you go. You're my biggest problem right now. Ow, you burnt me. Yeah, I'll just stay right here. You guys can roll around, right? Sure. Alright, so far not too bad. I'm going to take one heal. Take a knee. Okay. We are at silver. Let's go for gold. So far, not too big of a deal. I'm getting kind of used to the desert people. I don't want a hundred of them on me though. Yikes. Guys, I forgot my asbestos underwear. Really not supposed to be wearing it all the time. It gives me a rash. Two fireballs? Really? That's your difficult. Oh. Heal! I thought it was one dude that gave me two fireballs. Nope. It's two dudes standing on top of each other. You almost hit me with that, you. Blood crack? Okay. Which way are we headed? This way? Okay. I can do that. Trying to, trying to judge your your distance. It's like I think I can hit the no. You can't hit that. All right, we're going again. Heal. I should have more than enough to make my healing potions if I don't trade it off. Stop flaming me. This is a really bad time to get in a flame war. They don't call those of that anymore, do they? That used to be like a big term way back when. Stop hitting me with flame. <laughs> I will use my long stick. Boom. There we go. And that breaks that. All right. So yeah, this secret room is pretty cool. I like upgrading the chest. Ooh, destroy one artifact curse. Okay, this duplicates. What is that? Magnetic tool. Ooh. Um, destroy one artifact in the direction shown. Duplicate and duplicate. I've got so many great treasures. 
What do I want to get rid of? Fire gem? No. Fire jelly. Ooh, it's so tasty. Okay, um, geez, I'm gonna have a hard time here. I mean, I guess I don't need any more enchants, so these are kind of useless right this second. Don't close that, open it back up. I have some of the... See, here's the thing, because nobody has matching curses, you can't stack them, which sucks, and I don't know what I need. I want to take something that I don't already have, but I don't want it to replace something I don't already have as well. Are these just rich jelly? You know what? I'll put you here. I don't think I actually need any rich jelly. That's not what I'm after right now. I'll put you on the bottom. Throw you back over there. See, if this worked out to where I had something that was just blank and something that was cursed, I could strip the curse off of something and stack it on top of the rest. But it doesn't look like it's working out that way. Because all my um, resistant glass <laughs> has different curses. Sucks. Okay. Ugh. Ugh. Look, what's this? Desert stealing it? I'm definitely going to take that. Why did I... I mean, just to take curse off it, I guess, but... Thermomagnetic engine? I want that. That's a new item I don't have currently. They're magnet. I don't even know how much those are. Okay. So. No. Never leave anything in here, because it just it just gets destroyed. If you're gonna leave something behind, then you're just gonna leave it in the chest. Just sell it. Twelve thousand. Yeah. Okay. So let's climb up and hopefully not die. <laughs> I don't have the room. So this is floor one. All right, I'm going to use one of these suckers. There we go. I made this emblem, opens up a portal, but that it, here's the trick to this. Okay, you're gonna teleport back and because this dungeon is procedurally generated, which I mean, yeah, try not to roll off like that. Be because it's like that, you, uh, it basically resets. So anything you've killed off is going to come back. And anything you've visited, like a secret room, is gonna reset itself, but it's not gonna reset and give you more stuff. It's just, it's just gonna be like a blank room. That's why I couldn't use this down in the secret room, because it can't generate that way. Yes. But that's the only way to go down and come back, so... Telio Porto! Oh, and also... Um, so basically every time you go to town and come back, it uses half a day. Or... Like, I left at night, I came back, it's morning, or it's daytime. When I go back into the dungeon and I come back, it will be the night of that day. And I only point that out because sometimes you get these where uh, people come in and say, Hey, can you give me something? You know, I would like something in three days. If you warp back and forth like a couple times, you've lost all your days to get them whatever it was they wanted. Uh, do we know what these are? We do. Hmm. Okay, how about these? Nope. Okay, so we want one. I'm gonna put one down, I'm gonna say, ooh, I don't know, $2,000. Do you know what this is? No. What do you think? Mm, $2,000. One word. Thunder Cougar Falkenberg. 
two thousand dollars and hmm, oh, we've sold we know that's over a thousand dollars we don't know what this is so <sighs> let's see uh two thousand dollars <gasps> a thought occurs could i run my shop and then teleport back <laughs> i don't know see before i was thinking okay i'm gonna dump and go back right i've never tried running my shop yeah everything's just two thousand dollars so i see how much how much they want for it 400 bucks that wasn't even worth picking up wait i don't want that there I'm gonna guess this is not two thousand dollars. I'm gonna put fifteen hundred. And you, my good sir, shall be the fiesta de resistance of five thousand dollars. Hmm, very good. Okay, so I'm gonna try this with my portal open. I'm gonna go ahead and run my shop. I just want to see if it'll do it. It looks like it's holding. <laughs> That'd be so cool if it did. Yes, I've used them before, but never to do this. <laughs> this will be a heck of a re recording, let me tell you. It's the last time I did this. We took 20 minutes just to just to run the shop here. Okay. Ah. Uh, oh. He's mad about that. Okay, so $5,000 is not the price. Let's go to two. Also, let's get out here because there's going to be a thief. <laughs> no, thank you. Oh, $2,000 is way too cheap to sell that. Gotcha. <laughs> and apparently we t <laughs> See... People thought I was nuts when I started saying $2,000, but that's really my baseline. <laughs> I got one out there already. Do I have one of this out there already? No. Um, yeah, I'm thinking $2,000. <laughs> Two thousand is way too cheap. Well then, let's try. Three thousand dollars. Oh, what the heck? Four? No, three. Three. We'll do three. I'm not greedy. I am greedy. Okay, let's see. Did I put one of them out? Yes, I did. Reel it back in. How about that? Now we already know. Okay, we know. What do we know? Thousand dollars is cheap. Thousand dollars at regular price is too cheap. Let's go three. Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, just just try it. I don't even know. At this point. Okay. Um. I have so many other things. That's just regular price. That's fine. I can put some. Just for fun. You know what? Two thousand dollars. <laughs> Cause I kind, I kind of want to know the price of everything in the world. That is too high. Okay. Thank you, sir. My mistake. Oh yes. <gasps> May I help you? Yes, I'm looking for chilled lava. It has to be lava that's chilled. Three days from now, I would like five of them. I will pay you. $40,000. Could you gather five chilled lava and bring them to me in three days? I could give them to you right now. But yes, I can. Good, you like my price. Yeah, it's just some pots. There you go, sir. That's some pots. Uh, Grandma? Where's Grandma? Grandma didn't show up today. I'm worried. Grandpa, go check Grandma and Grandma. <laughs> $2,000? For fire jelly? This is an outrage! All right, all right, all right. I'll knock down my price. Thank you. Good morrow. 
<gasps> it's a steal. Then don't steal from me. I feel like I'm being taken advantage of. I don't like it. <laughs> You're gonna take them all? Well, you did say they were a decent price. Oh, hi, Grandma. Oh, I'm sorry I don't have anything on sale today. Not in the discount bin, anyway. Oh, stop there. You know what? You might as well give up. You are never getting something from me. Well, I take that back. I've lost two items. I'm still so ashamed. <gasps> 2,000. 2,000 is not enough. Okay. Yikes. You people. Uh, mental note. I'm going to guess it's about 500. Jelly don't go for much. Hold up, people, hold up. Well, again, we don't really know what that is. I like it on a neutral day. Mm, three or four? Three, four, three. Let's half it. 350. We'll meet in the middle. 2,000. Let's go three. Don't I have this somewhere? Yes, I do. And nobody's commented on it yet. How about this? That's kind of low. This? Ooh, this. I just want one. I have other things I need to... Let's go 2,000. Okay. Is it... What? 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 Oh, you're mad. Sorry. A thousand is too much? Really? 750? I go 750. No, no, that's a good price. 2000. Yes, 2000. Good price, good price. Good morrow, good morrow. Yes, good, good, good. Oh, we have sold a gem for something or other. 3000? Okay. Oh, you, you balked. 3,000 is too much, 2,000 is... Oh, okay. Well, split the difference. There we go. Hey, come back. I, I marked them down. Got a marked down price. 3,500 is still too cheap. Oh. You're taking me to the cleaners, lady. Ugh. So let's see. Do, do, do. Had three robbers. They didn't steal nothing. Wait, did they? No, I don't think so. Fire gem sold for three thousand. <laughs> Made seventy-three thousand six hundred and eighty-seven dollars. Not a bad day's haul. Did you imagine having a job where you make that much money? Oh, that would be great. <laughs> yeah. If I had that, I don't think I would tell anybody. <laughs> well, how much do you make? Oh, I make make a decent amount of money. <laughs> I, I'm not a flashy guy either. I wouldn't go for all the big stuff, you know. Money to me is freedom. It's not things. It's freedom. Freedom for having to, you know, report to somebody. Be somebody's, you know. It worked. It worked. I can run my shop. <laughs> That's great. And you know what? I'm all for that because these things are not cheap. <sighs> Sir, what do I need? Because I'm in the market for some extra stuff. I didn't go steal on that. Hmm, <sighs> I need one more of those, okay. Gotcha. How about this? Oh, yeah, of course. The one thing it's selling like hot cake. That's like the best thing to sell is what I need. Uh, of course. Um, let's add that to wish list and add this. No. Add this to wish list. That is a very pretty shield. I like that. Now, my question to you. And this is a question I have on most RPGs, because you don't know until you're actually doing it. This set, I'm going to guess, 
Like this set is earth, or this set is nat nature, this set is fire. It's 175 fire damage. Is that correct in me assuming that? Or does it mean 175 plus uh, it's, it's more hurtful to fire things? I've had games get do it both. So like you get fire on a weapon, it's either it does fire damage, which is great against like plants and etc., but not great against water and does nothing to fire. Or, you know, it's the other way. Anyway, yeah, this game really doesn't tell me, so I really don't know. But I'll just go with the base damage and just make everything clear. Uh, and on that note, let's see. Can I make some potions? I really need a few. Yeah, I need like three. We'll get geared up and ready to go. Okay, uh, potions please. No, I can't because I got fire jelly. Well, wait a minute. Hello. How can I help you? Ooh, those are 2,850 with my mats? Have you lost your mind? Oh, ooh, what's this? Restores full health and vital potion for the more difficult, more, more difficult dungeons. <laughs> Reveals the Golem dungeon map upon use. Seriously? The next floor of the Golem dungeon. I don't need any of that. forest dungeon reveal the desert dungeon map upon you but it changes every time so i guess it's a potion tech dungeon map upon use but i kind of have a system already in place it's called don't die no <laughs> all right i've got 15,000 for oh i'm gonna do it because I like to live. <laughs> Thank you, lady. Not kind, lady. <laughs> I understand. Everybody's making a profit here, but... Mm, I feel like I've been... Uh, <laughs> robbed. <laughs> I've been robbed. <laughs> yeah, let's just put everything away and we'll carry on down the hole here. Uh, here? Yes. I'd like to throw everything except these. Okay. All right. I'm geared up. I'm ready to go, I guess. Uh, I don't even sleep. It still gets the benefits of the bed. That's crazy. All right. Well, I'm going to end this recording here. We will start off heading back into the dungeon the next time I see you. Uh, anyway, thank you for hanging out with me. If you like this, go ahead and give me some likes. Give me some subscribes. Tell your friends. I've been seeing I've been attracting subscribers like crazy here lately. And, uh, Honestly, it's getting a little weird. Not that I'm getting subscribers, but because nobody is watching really my new stuff, which is this video right here. But they're watching the <laughs> this select few videos. If you've watched my channel, you understand what I'm talking about. And uh, yeah, these <laughs> that's where I'm getting all my base from. So anyway, I hope somebody's out there watching this and they're enjoying it. Give me some comments. I am more than happy to respond to people. Let me know what you think. And uh, I will see you guys later.